When sons and daughters of God communicate with Him, we call it prayer. When He communicates with us, it comes in a variety of methods, means, or channels. We're talking about the patterns whereby God communicates with His children here upon the earth. Revelation is communication from God to His children here upon the earth. Sometimes those messages come quickly and rather dramatically. I've compared that to a light being turned on in a dark room, where very suddenly the, the darkness is expelled and you can see everything in the room quite clearly and brilliantly. I would suggest that that pattern of receiving messages from God is more rare than common. A second pattern is when the light comes gradually, much like the rising of the sun. You can discern the increase of light on the horizon, but never all at once. This pattern of revelation, I would suggest, is more common than rare. Sometimes, receiving inspiration is like a foggy day. There's enough light that you can tell it's not darkness anymore, it's not night. But it's not brilliantly illuminated. You can see just enough to take a few steps ahead into the cloudiness. I don't know about other people, but it occurs that way for me all the time. There's enough to just take a few steps, and then the light continues to help me see just far enough ahead that I can continue to press forward. As we follow the teachings of Jesus Christ, He is the light. One of His names is the light. As we follow His example and live according to His teachings, there is illumination for all the aspects of our life. To the degree that we reject Him and reject His teachings, we're on our own. I much prefer to follow His light I know when there is a power beyond my own that comes from God to me and through me, which is the spirit of revelation.